Okay, I'm not sure how much battery life we're gonna have. We're on a red line on our phone. But I'll see what we get. We got Piper's meds. She gets a dose twice a day uh, for her pneumonia. You mentioned how she really, really, really doesn't like the needle. She really, really, really doesn't like the needle, but it also goes into her meat muscle, which she has very little of. So I understand why this is uncomfortable for her. But this. So Jordan's gonna lay her down. That's what he's doing. Um, hello, Brownie. How are you? Our neighbor dog. I thought our dogs were over here with you, Brownie. There's no way around this. She needs to have her needles. And we went with this drug in particular because of how potent it is, how strong it is. And technically she will be on this drug less longer than um, the other brand we could have gave her. So we went with twice a day with the stronger meds in hopes that it's less time. That's worried for her. So what Jordan's doing is asking her to come down by just holding her one leg up and gently putting pressure on her to come down. Gotta admit, this is just a baby. There she goes. It's a lot like trick training. <laughs> Took a minute longer than usual, but she knows now that she's getting a needle, so a uh, little bit of resistance. But we're hoping on the other side of this, she won't recall such a bad experience with getting needles when she's older. Cat really watches over her. Yeah, cat really likes her. Oh. When I gave you her the needle, she really yes. pawed and striked out and jumped and kicked. And I went this route because I can get her to fall asleep. And I can give her the needle while she not aware of it at all and cat will help wake her up. So there's no other ropes holding her legs down. She's just now laying down. Can you come and pet on her Hey. Okay. I try to go through this hot wire without turning it off and zapping myself. <laughs> and holding the camera. Good, nothing worse than zapping yourself. Yeah. We'll see. Just trying to video. I want to jab you. Alright, I'll put the needle away for now. Well, Maybe. I don't have the lid for it, so I'm just holding it. Oh, okay. Way easier to go this way then have her fight that needle you look at her eyes she's gonna fall asleep in a little bit and give her that needle and 
take this halter off and let cat and chick wake her up and she really really doesn't like needles It's going to be a little warmer. I could have gave you a bath. Yeah. Good girl. You just stay right here in case she tries to come up and you push down on her neck a little bit. I'm just going to stretch her legs out a bit and kind of rub all over them. And just stay close and just keep your hand right here. <laughs> I'll do my best. <laughs> <laughs> I literally am like holding the needle in my mouth and a <laughs> phone in my hand. And... You're right, just multitasking <laughs> champion. All right, Piper, see what we do for you. Yeah. Rubbing up and down your legs. Yeah, good girl. Good girl. You really do like this. You're getting better at laying <laughs> down. Yeah. So this is probably about the fourth time of laying her down like this to give her a needle. can unblock her energies from her front to back, top to bottom, all through her joints, all the way through her, and in this vulnerable of a position is extremely powerful that she's a grounded and in a form of submitting not in submitting in dominance, but submitting to the connection. <laughs> All right. Yeah, good girl. You are so smart. Right? Yeah. Oh, she's moving. You're so smart. Oh, look at her little lip. She had her little lip poking out. It was really interesting the second time I did this and I started moving her stomach around how much it, how many noises it made. 
Yeah. Yeah. That girl. I'm almost ready for a needle. Night. Your auntie coming over here to check on you. <laughs> I'm coming back. Yeah, it's really funny how those two take turns watching her. Yeah, here she comes. Yeah. Come back to check on her. Oh, here comes Cat too. Come back and make sure she's okay. Right, girls? Yeah. <laughs> really good support. <clears throat> you think we're gonna... a little bit twitchy. It gets on. Yeah. Jordan's rubbing her stomach, her little lip, her little top lip there gets pointed, kind of when you find a really good itchy spot. I think we're going to go right here on this part of the hind end of the needle. Okay. You want to give it to her? Uh, don't matter. Oh, You're I hate like... giving needles. <laughs> it's been a lot in the past few days. Like <laughs> just to not fight with her, that's why I lay her down and I'll just... Switch you. Get her to fall asleep while switch your spot. So let me take the oh camera. Oh my gosh. Oh. oh my gosh. I'm not good about being on the ground like that. Well, hey, maybe not videotape the whole needle part. Okay. Well, we'll just look on my girl. You okay? Look at that nose out of my needle face. Head girls. Ooh, they're so helpful. Head girls. Mm -hmm. They're so helpful. They are really helpful, especially for emotional support. There we go. Like it's not even happening. Right? The other horses are going to see about. No, it's in my brain. There you go. We gave needle her a needle. Done. Perfect. And we got our support got team here, right here. <laughs> we got Auntie saying, hey, that's our niece here. You make sure. Rub down her spot. Blocks. Right. Yes, I poked her right there. I know. I know. Poor girl. She just has to feel better. Right. Yeah, and she's just laying down, relaxed. No fight or resistance. Right. I know. Okay, I'm gonna pull your halter off here, so I'm gonna swap mommy. And then okay. You Crickets sound amazing over here. Really loud. Hi, you can get She's out. Mm. Oh, there's a lot. There yeah, she comes. Right. Nope. You're allowed to get up now. Nope, stretching, twitching. Yeah, <laughs> come back into her body. <laughs> it's so cool. She's uh, working through coming back. Come back stronger. Right. Yeah, healthier. Yeah. You can be a big, strong girl. You got a good support team right there for you. There you go. Hi. Not yet. She's like, not yet. If you've ever gone through a guided meditation, this is a very similar process, or I guess, feeling. Brownie. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, she's going down. No, oh, everybody's going to enjoy this. That's so funny. Cat's going to. They're all just on the wavelength. Look at them. They're really good sports. Systems, yeah, they? it's cool how power works, how energy works. The cat's trying to find her spot. That's <laughs> so great. Oh, that's really cool, everybody. Look at, they're all sharing the same frequency right there. That's awesome. And then we got these two shenaniganizers. Brownie. Really neat how they're in the same line. Right yeah, now. I thought that too. That they got they got in line with each other. Yeah. Yeah, that's really cool. She's out. Look at her. And you can see Chick, um, Chick's the black horse. You can see her have twitches. She's gonna go down too. And her, see how she, how um, Cat rolled? That's all energy pulsing through them. They're gonna be laid out if we leave them here long enough. Yeah. Yeah, just refreshed. It's really cool. Yeah, there's quite a few times I come out here and all three of them laid out like that. <laughs> yeah, they're very connected. But I love how energy works down the line. I've always loved showing those videos when you run energy down the line and I have all the horses standing there. You can literally send it down the line and watch each horse respond to it. That's pretty much what you got to see here. So even though we were working on Piper, it went down to these guys. Yeah. How did I know she was going to get laid out? Same with Cat. Cat's going through the twitches right now. She'll be laid out too. You know what the twitching is? I think a body twitch is more of like... your neurological system kind of energetically realigning itself. I was having that talk with Teslin about when I was in the ambulance, how my body went through all of it. Oh, look, she's even working her jaw. That's cool. <laughs> she's like wide open. Yeah, wide open mouth. Oh, you can hear her breathing it out too. That's cool. Oh, I bumped their bubble. Yeah, I bumped their bubble. But that's cool how much she was processing that. Very uh, sensitive to it. Look at her. She's like waking up with bad head, wondering where the heck she is and what day it is. <laughs> you mean Chick's gonna fall lay down again? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. You can see she's got body twitching again, so. Yeah, that's really cool. Kind of losing light on on us here. Anyways, isn't that 